My name is Sam Walker, and I'm here with Geek News Network at day two of CMX Comic Media and Expo in Mesa, Arizona. And I am here with Russ and Julia. They are the director and the screenwriter for a upcoming short, or not a short film, I'm sorry, for an actual feature length film called The Occupants. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that, Russ? Okay, Occupants is a film, it's about a young couple and one's a documentarian and they film a 30 days of clean living documentary and they set up cameras all over their house. Now while they're doing that they inadvertently uh, film a parallel version of themselves. Same house and it's them but they look different. She's a blonde in real life and the parallel version's a brunette just as an example. Now as the film goes along it becomes kind of horrific and they start interacting. Okay, so it is classified as a horror film then? It would be a sci-fi thriller horror found okay. footage film. Awesome. And I've got the writer here with me as well. This is Julia. Julia, was that your original concept is for it to go in that kind of sci-fi horror or did you have a different vision for it? So yeah, when I first had this idea, I'm like, this is going to be a awesome sci-fi concept, you know, and especially for actors to, to get a chance to play two characters. Uh, and really when you think about it, in a lot of ways, those two characters could be like the two sides of one person, you know, your darker side maybe. Uh, but was yeah. That, was that the original message that you wanted to send, uh, the double side of each person kind of thing? Well, yeah, I defi that's definitely something that I want people to think about, you know, when you see this like parallel version of yourself that's still married to a parallel version of your husband, uh, and they're doing things that you wouldn't necessarily do, but you know, but maybe you could. I don't know. I don't know. You know, I think I think we all have it in. Are you capable of doing that kind of thing? It makes you question that, right? Yeah, exactly. I really wanted to play with this idea of like, how far could you really go? Had you been pushed? Had you made different choices in life? Had you been pushed in a certain direction? Had you had a lot of disappointment? Like, who would you really be? And could there be a parallel version of you somewhere else, like doing something that? you maybe wouldn't do or would, I don't know. So now as writer and director, you guys have worked really closely on this project. Were there any um, problems running into that? Like any creative differences that had to be overcome or talked through or worked out or anything? Of course not. <laughs> Like, honestly, this was one of the easiest relationships I think I've had as far as writer-director. Uh, it jived really well. I think the film is coming out great, and Russ is great to work with, so. Well, ditto, Julia. <laughs> no, I meant, seriously, this script was just brilliant. It was an incredible script, and, yeah, it's it's, based, it's very psychological. Yeah. You know, it's, it's, it's a treasure trove for the actors, because they're playing two different characters. They doubt each other and themselves. I loved it. Is that what originally grabbed you about the idea to, to make this an actual thing? Or? Well, look, you have one location, you have two main actors. We got Robert Picardo already we're from Star Trek Voyager. <laughs> and, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Bob, here's, oh the, here's your outfit. And it, it was just, it was a brilliant idea. It could be done for, uh, you know, a very um, uh, mo moderate amount of, you know, money. And it had one location. It was just, it was an incredible idea. And, you know, we have a teaser trailer. You can go to occupantsthemovie.com and you can see it. And so far, people have been liking it. Awesome. So, so you've been getting good feedback from that then. Um, what is this that I hear about a first screening coming up? Or Yes, well, Julia here is a coveted member of the Writers Guild of America. Okay. And she was able to get us a screening at the Writers Guild of Amer America West in Hollywood. Oh, wow. And that's on December 14th. So that's our Fantastic. cast and crew film completion screening. Awesome. Yeah. All right. And what are the dates on that? Do you have those dates set up yet? Or? So, yeah. So that's December 14th. And that's, uh, yeah. Uh, that's not open to the public yet. That's our, you know, that's a private screening that we're having. And then we should be screening it more widely and come next year. So for now, you can check us out on the website, which is occupantsmovie.com. Uh, and you can check us out on Facebook. And where else are we? <laughs> Account. Twitter. If you go to, to occupantsthemovie.com. Occupantsthemovie.com. All the links are there. All the links are there. Like us on Facebook. Please. Hey, <laughs> be sure to check them out. See you guys. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.